Welcome parents, carers and guardians. I'm Miss Nixon, the head of year seven for September. The following presentation is to support your child's transition into high school. We are very sorry we are unable to offer face-to-face -face transition for you and your child. We hope the information provided gives you some guidance of what to expect when your child joins us in September. I'd like to introduce you to some of our staff members. Head teacher, Mr. Wadwa, Deputy head teacher, Mrs. Winters, Assistant head teacher, Mr. Noll, and Assistant head teacher, Mr. Sanger, who will support the year seven cohort. Myself, Miss Nixon, head of year seven, and Miss Coker, Deputy Head of Year 7 and Learning Mentor. At Featherstone High School, we have 10 form groups, which your child will be assigned to. Each form will have a form tutor attached to them. The form groups have been named after inspirational figures. Attendance and punctuality. At Featherstone High School, there is a large focus on your child's attendance and punctuality. We ask you, parents and carers, that you are legally responsible for ensuring that your child attends school on a day-to-day -day basis. If your child is ill or there's an exceptional circumstance, then we ask that you inform our attendance officer on the first day of absence and the reason for this. Punctuality also has a great impact on your child's attendance mark. Please encourage your child to arrive to school on time. Here we can see the evidence that shows there is a link between attendance and achievement. This is what your child's school day will look like in year seven. We ask all students to arrive by 8.20 a.m. in order for them to line up and make their way to their form room. Your child will receive their individual timetable in September, which will outline their lessons each day. Your child will finish at 2.15 p.m. unless they have an extended day. Our school's playgrounds are split into zones. Students from year seven will not mix with other year groups during break and lunch times. We have found this to be positive for the younger students, so they are not worried about the older students from other year groups. This still allows them to run and play around during these times. At Featherstone High, our uniform is an important part of our identity and helps our students to look smart and well presented. Details of our uniform are provided in the handbook. Please can we ask that trousers be loose fitting and skirts below the knee. Black shoes are to be worn, but please make sure that shoes do not look like trainers or plimsolls. We ask that students who must cover their hair for religious reasons, that the coverings must be plain black or dark blue. Hijabs and abayas must be plain black with no patterns, sequins or embroidery. Full uniform must be worn underneath, including a school skirt or trousers, no leggings. Tights or socks must also be black or dark blue. Our uniform expectations include items not to be worn in school. Please familiarise yourself with the list below as parents will be contacted if students fail to follow the school's uniform expectations. Details of the school's PE kit will be provided in the handbook. All PE kit must be plain with no visible logos and in the correct colours. Students will need to be organised and remember their PE kit as we are unable to lend out spare kit. 
At Featherstone High School, we encourage our students to be organised for their day-to-day -day ahead, ensuring that they are prepared for each lesson with all the appropriate equipment. We ask that you support your child in developing these organisational skills by encouraging them to pack their bag the night before, ensuring that they only have the books for that day needed. A student planner will be given to all students. These are given in order to create organisation and better communication skills. Students are more likely to keep track of their assignments and set personal goals whilst enhancing communication between teachers, students and yourselves. We ask that students carry their planner with them at all times. Parent and carers will be asked to check the planners on a weekly basis. Here is an example of what your child's planner will look like inside. We ask that your child writes the lesson and whether there's been homework set or not. Each day this will be recorded. Your child will follow the home learning timetable. Home learning. Home learning is an important aspect of your child's learning and development. Research shows that the impact of home learning can be an average of five months additional progress to your child. We ask that you support your child at home with this. At FHS, we have a newly refurbished, vibrant, and exciting library where your child can explore a wide range of books and research facilities. Our librarians are welcoming and supportive, allowing for a calm and safe learning environment. Google Classroom and Firefly are learning platforms that we use here at Featherstone. Students will be given guidance on how to use these learning platforms to support their class and home learning. Heads of years and form tutors will also use these platforms to share important information with students. Parents will also need to use online platforms. Firefly for Parents connects parents with student information, enabling you to receive notifications, view behaviour, attendance and have visible access to students' home learning. Operu is an online platform that can be accessed via the school's website. This allows you to consent for medical needs, confirm and update contact information. It is important that you keep all of your information updated in order for the school to be able to contact you or supply you with important information. At Featherstone, we are a cashless school. We use online platform ParentPay. This you can use to pay for materials, trips, additional payments and students' lunches. It is important that you keep your child's lunch account topped up regularly. Students' progress is monitored throughout the year with assessments and classwork. Information collected from primary schools is used to assess the progress as the students move up throughout the school. Three academic reports will be shared with you throughout the year. A traffic light system is used to identify how your child is progressing in each subject. You will be able to discuss students' progress with teachers on parents' evenings. At Featherstone, we feel it is so important to recognise and celebrate achievements. Throughout the year, we will celebrate achievements during registration, assemblies and celebration assemblies. Our achievements are not just awarded for academic success, so all students have the opportunity to receive recognition for progress, positive behaviour and improvement. A great way for your child to get involved in the school community and show off their talents and to meet others, we offer a range of extracurricular activities which you can see below. We are asking that your child continues their learning throughout the summer. Teachers have set work for your child to complete before September. 
please use the link provided below to access the summer home learning. Thank you for watching our presentation today. Letters will be sent out during the summer with details of year seven induction in September. Please take a look at the parent and student handbooks that have been uploaded on the school's website. This will give more detailed information, including what we have covered today. We look forward to seeing the students at our summer school on the 26th to the 30th of July or the 2nd to the 6th of August. Please remember school starts Friday the 3rd of September with our Year 7 Induction Day. Have a great summer and we look forward to seeing you all soon.